Hi everyone, so I'm going to show you how to control your expire contract. Here is important if I change the date to you see the date left. The date left is more, yes. And to do that, I will show you, yes, so I will delete and I will do it again. Yeah. In here, this is the start date, the validation as month, so it is 12 months. And expire day, we use the formula equal E date. And then start here, our start date and comma, this is the month, month, it is 12 months. Yes, so select on the month and then close bracket and minus one, yeah, we have to minus one. Enter, and you see, yeah. And when you drag down, it will so hashtag like this. So if you do not want to show the hashtag like this, you can use if function if the month equal nothing, and so it will display nothing. And then it did start, yes. And then I enter. Okay, yeah. Maybe I forgot to yeah close the bracket. So and then I will drag down. You see, yes, nothing so up. Day left, day left, we use equal and yes, expire day and minus today, yeah, today formula and you can track down yeah, when it's so the error like this, you do the same in here, we use if expire date equal nothing and then it will display nothing, okay, and then close bracket, enter, and then you track down again, yes, and so now it's not error, in here we want it to show as day so select all and right click and go to the format cell and we use the general yeah. From here you the general click ok and see if you want to display the day before you can reformat again select and right click and format cell and in here you can yes type day like this and then you click ok yeah, it will show up 355 days and the status status are you if function if they left yeah smaller or equal to zero yeah zero and then i will display the word it's by yeah, it's by already yeah it's by already yeah, it's by already it's like this and if yeah we can see in here and if they left smaller yes and if they left smaller or equal 14 yes i keep two weeks yeah, for two weeks to display and then it will show the message it spy soon yes, absolutely, yes, soon like this and then close your bracket and return here you see and track down and it's a call if here 2023 yeah, you, you see it's so it's by already, yeah, it's by 11 day already. And you can select and then you go home, go to conditional formatting, go to highlight, and if it is equal to the word, equal to the word, it's by, it's by already. And then it will show the red color like this, yeah. And see, yeah. And I change the month to January, you see, 20 days more. But if January and the, the date the day start from 15, let's do another row. It's called run house contract. Start from first, January 24, and then 12 months the same. You see, the same. And it's called bookstore. We start contract on first. Oh, sorry, yeah, we start contract, contract on. January 15, 23, and 12 months also, see, 3 days more will expire. And ABC suppliers, we start from, oh, we start from February 1st, 23, and 12 months also, see, yeah, 20 days more. But we can adjust in here, we can adjust to first. Yeah, you see, yeah, it is expire already and expire, it will display the red color and red tape like this.